The opening game of the 2013 Australian Ice Hockey League saw an understrength Perth Thunder play host to reigning champions, the Melbourne Ice. The Thunder were understrength due to their imports not having arrived in Australia in time for the puck dropping in Game 1. Following a face-off, good interplay between Sean Hamilton and Sam Wilson set up Kenny Rolfe for the Thunder, but his effort was blocked by the ice goaltender. The game was played at a frenetic pace and with plenty of passion shown by both sides. The ice broke out of defence through Matt Armstrong, who was slammed into the boards by Chris Roach. Jason Backlig tried to play in Austin McKenzie at the crease, but the shot eventually came from John Gordon. Michael Smart blocked and the Thunder scrambled the puck clear. Then a fast break up the ice saw Rick Del Basso set up Cameron Walsh, but on this occasion it was Pine Murphy who saved for the ice. The ice again tried to counter-attack quickly, and Armstrong attempted to crash the net. But once again, Smart stood tall for the Thunder and blocked. Early in the second period, the Thunder's Jordan Kairos tried a slap shot from the blue line, but Pine Murphy denied him. Then an errant pass by Sam Wilson gave possession to Vinnie Hughes, who picked out Armstrong, who went one-on-one -on -one with Smart but the goaltender's butterfly save deflected the puck wide. Minutes later, a sharp shot from Liam Jeffries was blocked by Pine Murphy, and David Ruck was first to the rebound, but the goaltender blocked his follow-up shot. The deadlock was finally broken when the puck came to John Gordon following a face-off, and with the Thunder short-handed, his slap shot fizzed past Smart and into the net.